You call yourself a beta male and a liberal, right? Uh, sure. Are you a liberal male? I am liberal. And are you a beta male? <laughs> sure. Really? <laughs> and you know that a liberal male means that you're a weak man, right? I'm you stronger than and, you, but... You think and okay. act like a woman. Does that make not, someone weak? Yeah, not a real... act like a woman? Yeah. You don't think so? No. You don't think if you're weak, you act like a female? No. You think you act like a man? Yeah. Well, why are you weak? I'm not weak. You're just like your mother. That's good. My mother's a great person. You're just like her? Yeah. Beta! Women are not going to like you being like that. They're going to beat you up. Women, are, women like me. Have it's you fun. ever dated? Yeah. Have you ever dated black? Yeah. Did you go back? Uh, sure. You went back from being, yeah. once you dated black? I don't discriminate. Can you go back once you date black? Uh, yeah. You dated white? Yeah. Asian? Yeah. Mexican? Yeah. Just anything? Yeah. Amazing. Discrimination's wrong. Oh, yeah, you don't discriminate? No. You never discriminate? I try not to. Do you ever discriminate? No. You never discriminate? No. So when you took the bus here today, wasn't that a discrimination against the car? Yes. Not drive? So you do oh, discriminate. Oh, absolutely. I'll discriminate against things that are bad, just yeah. not against people. And so you are discriminating against me by disagreeing, right? Uh, no, that's not yes, how you that are. works. I'm not pro-Black Lives Matter. That's a radical, evil, agitated organization that was uh, founded by black lesbians and uh, black radical homosexuals and social justice warriors. Well, what's wrong with so black lesbians? So you're discriminating against me, right? Because I just agree with that. I will disagree. I will discriminate against you all day for hating black lesbians. I don't hate. Well, why, why I did disagree, you scream but black I don't lesbians? Hate. Why you discriminate against me if you don't discriminate? Uh, why I don't discriminate on the, based on the color of people's skin. Why are you discriminating against me? You say you do not discriminate. Well, some things are bad. So you some do discriminate. Some things are good. So you do discriminate. Among good and bad things, yes. You do discriminate. Yeah. Okay, so you take that back when you say you don't discriminate. Uh, I take back when I... No, I don't. What? Some things are good. Some things are bad. And do you discriminate? Against the bad things, absolutely. Okay, so you do discriminate then? Yes, against bad things. Amazing. And so you say you are liberal, which means you're beta, beta male, and what is a beta male? To me? Uh-huh. Well, to me, beta male is a term made up by people who like toxic masculinity. To and what is toxic to masculinity? It's a version of masculinity where you define the male identity in something that's aggressive and harmful to other people. But what's wrong with being aggressive as a man? Well, it's harmful to other people. How is it harmful to other people? Well, if you're using your aggression to do harm, then it's harmful to other but, people. But uh, alpha males don't use aggression because they're real men and they don't need to use that. It's natural for them to be that way. A beta male have to use aggression. So you say what, you What is an alpha male to you? A, a real man, not a liberal, not a beta, but a man of courage, of perfect love, of truth and honesty, not afraid, can give and take. He has courage. He's not a beta. Those sound like liberal values. No, those are not liberal values. You're those just like your values. mother, right? Yeah. You're just like your mother. My mother is courageous and honest. And you're just like your mother? Yeah. Amazing. Your mother's a beta woman? Uh, is she what? A beta woman. Well, no. She's alpha. You just said she's courageous and honest. No. I didn't say that about your you mother. You said alpha is courageous, honest, strong. I didn't say that about your mother. You said you're just like your mother. You are a liberal beta. So you promote, you support... You a pro LGBTQ? Uh, yes, I. That's a homosexual those. thing, right? Uh, among other things, yes. Why do you support homosexuals? Uh, because they're human beings. How do you know? How do I know that homosexuals are human beings? Are they normal? Well, they're a minority. Are they normal? Um, no, they're a minority. Are they normal? No, they're a minority. Are they normal? You said, no, they're not normal? No. And so why do you support the homosexual? Would you marry one? Um, no, I'm not a homosexual. Oh. I would marry a bisexual person. Oh, you would? Yeah. Why would you ma Would you want your son to be a homosexual? Uh, I would be okay with it. You would, be, would, would you want your son to be a homosexual? I have no strong feelings one way or the other. Would you want your daughter to be a LGBTQ? I have no strong feelings one way or the other. Do you care about right from wrong? Yes. Is it normal to be that way? 
is, is normal defining right and wrong? Is it normal to be a LGBTQ? I don't think you should define right and wrong based on some median. Is that normal? Is it normal? No, is it normal? Well, what does normal mean? You don't know what normal means? Well, you can define it in many different ways. How do you define it? Well, I would say average. It sounds like what you're saying is average. You think the LGBTQ are average? average? Oh, I don't think they're average. It's... You think they're abnormal? I think they're not the median. They're not the majority. And why do they keep begging and blaming and complaining? Well, because they didn't have the same rights as us. Well, same rights that they didn't have that you had or have. Well, the right to marry who they love. They, they can marry who they love. Yes, now they can. They always had that. No. Yeah, they could have just married them and stayed with them and never not flying in front of the normal people. Because they're still not married. Well, they just got the right to marry in But that doesn't make them marry just because the, the law says that they're married. They're not really married. You it's, can't marry the same sex. You can. You can. You can. You can say you are, but in reality, they're not married. It's an illusion. Do you like illusion or you like the real deal? Well, I like the real world. So is being married to another man the real deal? Oh, uh, yeah. That's real to you? Yes. And what is an illusion? What is an illusion is something that's fake. Something that's fake? You don't think marriage the same sex is fake? No. Why do they have to go outside of their homosexuality to have a child if it's normal? Heterosexual people well, they, don't have to go don't. outside. They can adopt. No, but they still have to go outside. They can't lay with each other and make a baby. But they can't lay with each but other. But a man and a woman can do that. That's, that's a good point. Don't you think that's abnormal? If God had wanted them that way, he knew they wanted kids. He would have made them popular, God right? God didn't want them that way, he wouldn't have made them that way. He didn't make them that way. He did. Satan did. Satan? They were traumatized. Satan does not have that kind of power. No, they were traumatized. He messed with their mind. They think that they are. So is a man thinking, so as he is. You agree to that? Uh, have you seen Satan do this? Have you, do you agree to that? Yes, I have. You've seen Satan do I've this? I've seen what Satan met with people's mind. Okay. Yeah. And I've seen people overcome the mind. They overcome the fall. Do you believe most people are in a fallen state? Uh, no. You don't believe in most people in a fallen state? No. Have you, are you in a fallen state? No, I'm in California. Have you ever been in a fallen state? Uh, no. Do you know what it means to be in a fallen well, state? Well, let me correct that. I've been in West Virginia. It's not doing great right now. Do you know what it means for human beings to be in a fallen state? No. Amazing. I told you you got into I, MIT and USC based on color. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to be a badass today. So far, you're you, not you bad. Know, you know that California doesn't have uh, affirmative action, right? Um, I know that it was supposed to be taken away, but some of the schools sneaking in anyway, oh. especially when it comes to black people. Um, you're pro-choice. Uh, yes. What does that mean? It means that a woman has the right to choose. So you think just like a woman, but you like your mother, right? Uh, what? You like your mother, right? I am like my mother. That's why you think and feel like a woman. <laughs> I don't think I feel like a woman. But only women think that, not all of course. Only women think? Only women think that, and beta males think that it's all right women, to kill a baby inside her womb. Only women and beta males think that women have rights? Uh, only beta males and women think that it's okay for a woman to kill a baby inside the womb. Well, it's not a baby. But it is a baby. It's a fetus. But Do you think that it's okay to kill a baby inside the womb? Well, it's not a baby, but... Do you believe it's okay? I think a woman has a right to choose. Uh, to choose what? To choose whatever she wants to do. To kill a baby? To make her own private <laughs> medical decisions. And who gave her that right? Well, the U.S. The U.S. gave her that right to yeah. have an abortion? Yeah. Did God give her that right? Sure. God gave her the right to kill a baby? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Are your brother watching? He is. He's going to be ashamed of you. Oh, I don't think so. No, is he like you? He is. He's just like his mother, too? Well, he's a little more conservative. Oh, I he mean, is? he's a fan of your show. Oh, right on. His name's George? Yeah. Hey, George! I'm sorry about your brother. Don't encourage him. He said he's a badass, and he is. No, don't encourage him. No, thank you, George. Oh.